Before operating the machine, thoroughly read safety and operation information in the operator's manual. The corner post display provides essential machine information to the operator. The display is divided into three basic areas. From top to bottom, these are warning indicators, engine and drivetrain information area, and the cotton handling systems area. Three warning indicators are included at the top of the display. These are stop engine, caution, and service information. If any of these indicators illuminate, corresponding diagnostic trouble codes or DTC messages will be available on the command center display. If the stop engine light illuminates, a serious problem has been detected and immediate shutdown of the machine is required to prevent machine damage. Diagnostic trouble codes relating to the problem will be immediately displayed on the command center. Caution indicates that a problem has been detected that should be resolved soon to prevent adverse effects on the performance of the machine. However, immediate shutdown is not required. Diagnostic trouble codes relating to the problem will be immediately displayed on the command center. The information light advises the operator of less serious system conditions that may result from incorrect operator input or other operating conditions. Messages or alerts relating to the problem will be displayed on the command center. Also included with the warning indicators are the turn signal indicators and high beam headlights indicator which illuminates when the field lights are on. The engine and drivetrain information area has bar type gauges for engine power output, engine coolant temperature, fuel level, and diesel exhaust fluid or DEF level. Numeric readouts are displayed for engine RPM and ground speed. In addition, an exhaust filter cleaning indicator illuminates when the machine is performing active exhaust filter cleaning. The display also includes indicators for current transmission range and parking brake engagement. The upper portion of the cotton handling system window contains two numeric displays of information relating to the harvest systems on the machine. The upper line displays moistener system solution pressure on the CP690 cotton picker and cleaner saw drum speed on the CS690 cotton stripper. The lower line displays cotton fan speed on the CP690 and header speed on the CS690. The middle portion of the cotton handling system window contains icons that represent the round module builder or RMB. The icons change depending on the machine configuration and functional status of RMB components. Icons are displayed to represent the RMB frame, the RMB gate, and rear module handler. In addition, icons are displayed to indicate rotation of the feed and metering rolls in the accumulator and the cotton feeder belt. Icons display continuously when in their correct and normal operating position. Icons flash on and off whenever components are moving or are not in their normal operating position for the current machine configuration. An example is the gate icon which flashes while the gate is open during the ejection cycle. The icon displays steady when the gate closes and latches and module formation can begin. Module icons within the RMB indicate rotation and building of the module and the presence of a module on the handler. Finally, the module on handler icon moves to the right side of the display and disappears when the module rolls off and the handler can be raised. Triangle arrows indicate the direction of movement of the handler when commanded by the operator. Near the left edge of the window, Icons indicate the approximate accumulator cotton fill progress, operation of the accumulator auger, 
and the RMB Auto mode status. The machine is in auto mode when the icon is displayed continuously. When auto is flashing, activate by pressing the auto button on the multifunction lever. Near the bottom of the cotton handling system window is a wrap process status bar and numeric displays of current approximate module diameter and number of remaining wrap portions on the current wrap roll. For more detailed information, refer to the operator's manual.